Deuteronomy 136. Zulati Kalev ben Yefune, who yer ena ve lo etain et haaretz asher darach ba u levanav yaan asher mile achare adonai. So we go back and get a full translation here. We would have except Caleb, and again, if we tie this back to verse 35. We know that the Lord said nobody in this evil generation will see the good land except Caleb, the son of Jephunneh, he. He will see it. There's our pronominal suffix on the root ra'ah. He will see it. And to him I will give, direct object marker, the land, the land which he has trodden in it and to his sons on account of which, or because, on account of which, he was full, or existed as full, after the Lord. So let's go back and look at a few pieces here. Uh, except Caleb, the son of Jephunneh. Here we have an appositional modifier telling who Caleb is, the son of Jephunneh. Then we get the subject fronted here, I think, for emphasis, or at least to tell us something about Caleb again. He he will possess it. He will see it. And so here we have the call imperfect 3ms of the root ra'a plus the 3fs pronominal suffix here. He will see it. The 3fs is referring to the land, which is also a feminine word. Come down to the next line. And one thing I want you to notice here is, and to him and to his offspring form kind of a bookends on this this section so to him i will i will give so what we have here on i will give is the call imperfect 1 cs of natan again we lose the one noon but right there it is as the dagesh i will give the land the land which he has trodden that's a perfect call perfect 3 ms of the root darach in it, which he has trodden in it. This is a perfect example of where we go to the end of a relative clause right here, and we find the preposition to bring back to the front for good English. So in good English, we don't say which he has trodden in it. We say in which he has trodden. So that would work. And to his children, uh, on account of which or because he was full after the Lord. The full here is a PL perfect, 3ms of the root malay, and what we have here is taking after as a locative, we would say he followed fully after the Lord.